Are you ready to transform your summer into an epic splash-tastic adventure? Say goodbye to wasteful, single-use water balloons and hello to the ultimate in reusable, eco-friendly fun with reusable water balloons. Check out the link in the video description to get yours on Amazon today. Before the Jonas Brothers starred in Camp Rock or debuted at number one on the Billboard Hot 100, they had just two major supporters, their parents, Kevin Jonas Sr. and Denise Jonas. The couple raised their four sons, Kevin, Joe, Nick and Frankie, in Wyckoff, New Jersey, before relocating to the town of Little Falls, where the older three brothers recorded what would become the first Jonas Brothers album. Kevin Sr. and Denise were so devoted to the band in its early days that Kevin Sr. lost his position as pastor at their church in New Jersey. The family suffered financially and emotionally after being cut off from that community, but the Jonas Brothers quickly found massive success after the release of their self-titled album in 2007. The brothers' talent didn't come out of nowhere, both Kevin Sr. and Denise were singers who specialized in Christian music. They also passed on the gene to their youngest son, Frankie Jonas, who released his first single, Cocaine, in February 2023. Kevin Sr. celebrated Frankie's music video with a post on Instagram. In the comments, Frankie wrote, Love you dad, you are my biggest inspiration. And you always will be. These days, the couple is busy running their Southern Comfort food restaurant franchise, Nellie's Southern Kitchen, and spending time with their five granddaughters. So, who are the Jonas Brothers' number one fans? Here's everything to know about Kevin Jonas Sr. and Denise Jonas. Sparks flew instantly between Kevin Sr. and Denise when they met on their first day of college at Christ for the Nations Institute in Dallas. They quickly fell for each other in the registration line. He was talking about working at a summer camp with these young kids, and all his passion and heart for them. And I thought, he could be a wonderful father someday, Denise recalled to Good Housekeeping. Six months later, Kevin Sr. proposed and the two were engaged. They married in August 1985 at just 18 years old. Kevin Sr. and Denise are the loving parents of Kevin Jr., Joe, Nick and Frankie, who is often referred to as the Bonus Jonas. Between Kevin, Joe and Nick's children, the couple has five grandchildren. Kevin and his wife, Danielle Jonas, have two daughters, Elena Rose and Valentina Angelina, born in February 2014 and October 2016, respectively. Nick and his wife, Priyanka Chopra Jonas, welcomed their baby, Malti Marie Chopra, in January 2022 via surrogate. Joe and Sophie Turner welcomed their daughter, Willa, on July 22, 2020, followed by another baby girl who arrived in July 2022. Shortly after learning she was going to be a first-time grandmother, Denise shared on Twitter how excited she was to finally have a girl in the family after raising four sons. I am so blessed to have a granddaughter, she wrote. Musical chops run in the whole Jonas family. Back in 1990, Kevin Sr. taught songwriting and wrote and recorded Christian music at Christ for the Nations Institute in Dallas, where he and Denise had met. Denise worked in the school registrar's office, and she was also a singer. We would take Christian singing groups on the road, so when I traveled, the boys would travel with me and Denise, Kevin Sr. told our channel in 2008. The family, which then included Kevin Jr. and Joe, would spend several months at a time traveling in a 15-passenger van. After Nick was born, the family settled in Wyckoff, New Jersey, after Kevin Sr. was offered a job as a senior pastor at a church in the area. The family would eventually part ways with the church when questions about Kevin Sr.'s priorities arose as the boys' band became popular. The former pastor still enjoys performing to this day. At Nick and Priyanka's wedding in December 2018, Kevin Sr. performed a rendition of Elton John's Can You Feel the Love Tonight while Denise, a former American Sign Language teacher, joined him on stage to interpret the song in ASL. And in October 2023, he joined his sons on stage in Nashville to sing a cover of the Eagles rock ballad Desperado. Kevin Sr. also keeps his love of music alive with his podcast Legendary with Kevin Jonas Sr., on which he discusses legendary moments with icons in the entertainment industry. Both Joe and Nick have been guests on the show. When he was six years old, Nick accompanied Denise to a salon, where he began to sing while she got her hair done. Another customer mentioned that her son was an acto.